Uh, Standby came about a long time ago. It came in about almost 10 years ago. Uh, Keith and Al are best friends, and they wrote this show in, in 2003 together out in San Diego. Standby feels more like it's a complete musical now than it did when it was at Fringe. At Fringe was a, a rebirthing process. It was finding what was important in the show and then enhancing it and starting to kind of focus on those things. And then Nymph really gave us the opportunity to develop the piece into what we want it to be. Our characters are so much more general originally. We didn't have a soldier, we just had someone that was dealing with a failed relationship, you know? And we didn't have, um, we didn't have, Cynthia was not a girl who had lost her job and was, was you know, oh, away from her fiance. She was just a girl that was, uh, again, like lost in love and heartbroken. So now we've dove so deeply into these characters and pulled out so much more, so much more of a backstory. My big thing coming to the table was um, connections. I really wanted to emphasize the connections and baggage and uh, play with the, the, the scary elements of the show. And that's that's really what I what I brought to it. And that was about a year ago, a little more than a year ago. Everything's been rewritten a hundred times. <laughs> I would say that the only song, every song's been rewritten. The only song that is really close, I would say, is, as it was originally, would be um, Breakdown and um, what the H E double L, the two um, kind of funk songs in the show. The biggest rewrite of all was the opening. And a lot of people say, don't write your opening until you've written the entire musical because you will probably have to throw it away because you've been on such a journey. And I would have to say that's the case. Uh, we've been really lucky as a production to work with two really supportive units. We had Fringe last year and they were right behind us the whole way. We got encores, they extended us, it was great. Uh, Nymph really took us under its wing. They have a, a project called Next Link where they pick 10 shows that they just work with. So this time around, we just dive into the conflict head on and bring out, bring those guitars, bring out the rawness, the dissonance in these people's and their lives and their struggle. And it makes the show, you know, Full, and complete, and complex. And they care. They want to produce musicals, and they want to showcase what the next, the next show, the next big thing. And it's never done. It's always a work in progress. But I think that's the big thing. We have the orchestrations. We've got the drama. We've got the story. We've got the continuity. 